everyone, it's Cannibal Cat, and I'm here with a vlog on this super cloudy day. It's actually supposed to start raining soon, but nothing will stop me because I did makeup. I have to go out and do things. Um, so it's an otter vlog. Let me just grab my friend here. Butter, my love. Um, so there are some weird people out today. There's like a, I don't know if you can see him. Right over there, just he's just a fucking old man on like a red bike thing. I don't know. My town is fucking weird. Um, I'm gonna film two vlogs today. So you probably guys are probably like, just Claire, fucking get on with it. What the fuck are you talking about today? So, auto vlog. Um, I'm wearing a scarf on my head because scarves are cute. You, someone, someone, I guarantee, someone's gonna be like cultural appropriation. That's a hijab or whatever you call it. I don't know what it is. It's god it's goddamn hand scarf. Anyone can wear them. I am not appropriating anyone's culture. That might be an entirely separate video because it's fucking stupid. Anyway, um I'm here today because I've noticed something and it legitimately bothers me. I'm usually not someone who speaks out against like social issues or fucking anything cuz I honestly could give less of a shit. But I just want to speculate on something today and that is why is the goth punk alternative subcultures so white why like it is so hard to find people of color or anyone who's just not white be into like goth or punk or anything and it kind of i don't know it bothers me like why are they just like not into it or are we like alienating them because if we're alienating them we need to fucking stop like some people it's been uh said that some people will be like, uh, you can't be goth if you're not white. No! Goddamn no. Motherfucking no. Holy shit, no. You can be goth no matter who you are. You can be punk no matter who you are. You can be whoever the fuck you are no matter the color of your skin. Um, and it just, it makes me really happy when I'm on Tumblr and I see someone who's, you know, not white. Literally anyone who's not white just, you know, be goth. And I'm like, you're doing you, fam. You probably aren't accepted. It's probably like 10 times worse because not only are you of an alternative some culture, but you're also a minority. You're a minority of a minority and that would fucking, that would blow so hard. So I just really want people to be accepted. And I'm gonna make an entirely like separate vlog that's kind of like, I'm a hypocrite guys. You guys are gonna slowly figure this out that I am a large hypocrite. I, I just, so many conflicting opinions all at once. It's very bothersome. But, um, oh, look at the doggo. There's a doggo. Do you see? There's a, there's a dog. Doggo. Go, dog, go, 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 go! <laughs> yes. Um, yeah, it's supposed to rain. Look at, look at the sky. Look at the sky. Um, so, I just went off a fucking trail of thought. Thought trail? Me. Over there. Not, not one anymore. Um, so yeah, I just want, I don't know, stop being racist, guys. Fucking, <laughs> in general. Especially with alternative subcultures. Like, I think it's the fucking coolest thing. Like, I almost, I guess it kind of ties into another vlog I'm going to do today. I'm just so tired of seeing, like, the super generic goth people. I'm like, I want to see the alternatives of the alternative, you know? Like, I think it's so cool to see, like, black goths and, like, like uh, Arabian goths. And it's just, it's so cool. And another thing, if you think this looks like a hijab, or a headscarf of some sort, look at how cute it is. It's so goth. You can totally do it. You can pull it off. If you think you can't pull it off, you're fucking wrong. I hate people who are like, I want to be this, but I don't think I can pull it off. No. Just do it. It's your life, dude. You only have one shot to be what you want. If you had one opportunity, would you take it or just let it slip? Yo, I could, I could rap that entire song right now. But I'm not gonna, because... You guys don't want to hear that. Um, I probably should have filmed a tutorial on this makeup look today, but it's very heavily inspired by um, It's Black Friday. I think she's lovely, and I love her very much. And yet, this next vlog I'm going to be <laughs> filming is going to say the exact opposite of that. <laughs> My life, what is it? Um, and... I got a Labre piercing. It's healing. It hurts. It hurts a lot more than the sides, actually, because it's so, like, 
center front point of like your face and your mouth that you do things with. So it's like constantly being moved around and it's like, ouch. Um, so, I guess this is going to be a short vlog compared to what I'm about to talk about. Um, I just, I wanted to like speculate. Guys, please, if you have an answer to like why there was like such a lack of like people of color in the alternative subcultures, please tell me. Um, my thoughts are that it's probably just people very much so identify with it, but they don't want to put themselves out more because like you're already a minority. Why would you want to be more of a minority? Like, that would suck. I can understand their places. So, I don't know. I just want people to be a little more fearless in this time. Where it's like, everything's being a lot more accepted. You should probably just say fuck it and do whatever the fuck you want. Um, did you see that guy just like looking at me like, what is this chick doing here? He's in my bleachers. He's a fuck out. Um, yeah, so just do whatever the fuck you want. Uh, you can be whoever you want to be. That's basically, like, the case and point to all my vlogs. Vlog vlogs. Vlog vlogs. Otter vlogs. Blood of the Otter. Um. Does anyone else, like, file their nails into points and then just, like, they break and you're like, fuck it? That's my life. Uh, because I'm too poor to afford the acrylic ones. Still looking for a job. No one wants me. So I sit here and vlog. Oh, I'm going to see The Darkness in a few days. If any of you know that band. They're amazing, lovely, very excited to see them. Um, so yeah, I guess I'm gonna stop this vlog and start the other one because I have some shit to say to all of y'all and usually I don't like making two videos on the same day because you just see my same face. But maybe I'll somehow space this one out because fucking life. Um, so yeah, hit, hit buttons down by my stupid face if you want to see more of my stupid face. Uh, I, you know how I was doing the Enslade thing? That's too much work. Uh, if you want to find me on literally uh, Twitter, I'm on a hiatus from Tumblr because Tumblr's weird. Um, Twitter, Tumblr, Instagram, Snapchat, all CandlecatX. One word. Same shit. Just do it, man. Um, I love you guys. Uh, stay, stay nice. Be accepting. Please be accepting. Don't fucking shove people out of things that are awesome. Um, so yeah, I love you guys. Bye.